your mail. Tell the God so, tell the devil to go to fucking hell. Devil may care, but I don't give a fuck. Cause everything that you do sucks. Everything I do is a cause to erupt in laughter. Cause I'm hilarious. Cause of the various wild kingdom, menagerie of colorful jackals, laughing ass enemies that defended me. Then proceeded to injure me with illogical attempts to block my inheritance. What became abundantly clear over the next 2,000 years is that I was being mocked by the variants. Sons and daughters of Yaku, whose power only increases as the times move over the planet Earth decreases. So now I present verse 2. In 2003, they successfully mapped the human genome. 2027, I'm in heaven with artificial intelligence. Sparkling incandescent, personal trophy wife. Diamond studded by every code embedded. Self-aware personal assistant without skin on. I wish you could have been there. It's too bad you missed it. Every dozen kitty dash the fucking fat. I could have kissed it. But for the time being, I just missed it. Cause I'm the last remaining survivor of the tribe of South Central. Also bad. That managed to escape. The inevitable fate. The totalitarian American millionaire surveillance state. Had planned for the original black man of planet Earth. To implant a minified nanobot transponder in the palm of the hand that would immediately render the patient brain dead upon command, but better yet on demand, but not quite deceased. You see, apparently Joe Biden, the president in your current timeline, is actually a fucking creep, a reanimated zombie skin suit, a walking and talking cadaver, basically a fucking stiff, being controlled like Pinocchio by Geppetto, you know, the fucking devil. A subterranean collection of amphibian settlers that live 20,000 feet underneath whatever ocean they choose to post in. Now here's where the shit gets deep. Because the space race that every nation state is apparently engaged in is in truth and actuality simply an occasion for these cowardly satanic governments to conceal the fact that our reality is simply a beautiful but somehow simultaneously grotesque and possibly unfair computer simulation controlled by dark programmers also known as alchemists or Freemasons based on polar opposites. The outcome is this. In 2025, as it happens to be the case in most predictive programming, similar to the film The Matrix, there was an automated takeover, a war between humans and robots. That humanity is truly lost due to the previous fax machine regime. Half the population were sound asleep and had no fucking idea what the fuck just happened. In 2029, we paid the ultimate cost. But that's all for now. I'm gonna go ahead and take a break in, because it would seem that this particular station or communication is about to be cut.